DTCP approval. In this video, we are going to see about DTCP approval. What are all the documents required to get DTCP approval? How much amount is to be paid to the DTCP for land approval? Now let's go into the video. First let us see what is meant by DTCP. DTCP means Directorate of Town and Country Planning. It is a government department that helps in planning and regulating rural and urban growth in different states or locations. A property without DTCP approval may be considered as illegal. If you buy a plot that doesn't have DTCP approval and wish to build for residential or commercial purposes, you may have to face legal consequences. Why is DTCP approval so beneficial? The primary benefit of DTCP certification is that it allows you to obtain a house loan from any bank or financial institution. The important thing is that if you buy DTCP approved plots and villas, there will be no legal issues in the future. You will live happily without any worries about your property. What are the advantages of DTCP approval? DT DTCP approval helps the buyer be clear about the necessary infrastructure around the plot and facilities for living such as roads, drainage, water supply, sewage system, gated community plots and other amenities that are necessary for living. Another thing is that most buyers prefer DTCP approved plots. It has a higher reason value because it is an investment plot. If they want to sell the plot or villa, DTCP certification makes it easier for them to do so in its current state without negotiation. Now let's see what are the documents needed for DTCP approval. First one is parent document. Second one is sales deed. Patta copy. EC. EC means encumbrance certificate which you want to get from the year 2016. NOC. No objection certificate from the concerned authorities. Soil test report. Survey sketch of the land. Applicant's order card. SPFW number which means sold plot framework number. Based on this SPFW number, you get DTCP number for your site. Then any other document as per the government norms. You can apply in Panjait office or in municipality office or in corporation office. DTCP approval price hike details. For Panjait limit, new price for 1 square meter is rupees 77.5. Municipal limit for 1 square meter is rupees 255. Corporation limit for 1 square meter is rupees 675. Panchayat limit for 1 cent which is 436.5 square feet the amount is rupees 3140. Municipal for 1 cent the amount is rupees 10300. Corporation limit for 1 cent the amount is rupees 27,320. Next for 2.75 cent which is half ground. For Panchayat limit the amount is rupees 8,630. For municipal limit the amount is rupees 28,400. Corporation the amount is rupees 75,178. Next 5.5 cent which is one ground. For Panchayat limit, the amount is rupees 17,260. Municipal limit, the amount is rupees 56,800. Corporation limit, the amount is rupees 1,50,350. How long does it take to get DTCP approval? It will take around 2-3 to three weeks or maybe a month. These are all about the details of DTCP approval. I hope this video is useful to you. If you want this free PDF of 
DTCP approval price kindly check the description box given below if you like this video kindly do subscribe civil engineering shailus updates thank you